for our recipe today we are going to use 600 grams of chicken this is chicken drumsticks you can use them with or without skin completely up to you and we are going to marinate these chicken drumsticks with our bhuna masala and then we are going to cook them in the oven for our bhuna masala chicken we are going to use onion about half a cup chopped one green chili chopped if you don't like spice you can de-seed the chili or use it along with the seeds here we have chopped ginger and two cloves of garlic chopped spices we are going to use turmeric that's haldi half a teaspoon red chili powder half a teaspoon garam masala cumin seeds half a teaspoon salt as per taste and coriander seeds half a teaspoon so begin by heating two tablespoons of oil in a pan in a wok and once the oil is hot go ahead and add half a teaspoon of cumin seeds and half a teaspoon of coriander we'll give our sizzling spices about 30 seconds and then add your onions ginger garlic and green chilies we're gonna give them a quick stir and add our spices salt turmeric and red chili powder adding the red chili powder about half a teaspoon you can eliminate it if you don't like too much spice half a teaspoon of salt for 600 grams of chicken and half a teaspoon of turmeric mixing these ingredients well together give your masala about two minutes once onions start becoming golden we will turn the heat off let our masala cool down and then put it in the blender to have a smooth paste our masala is done we are going to let it cool down so in my blending jar here i have three tablespoons of yogurt in this i'm going to add this masala and we are going to blend everything together you can use greek yogurt or plain homemade yogurt now along with the onions ginger and garlic various spices and yogurt i'm also adding half a teaspoon of garam masala and we are going to mix everything well and blend it masala paste is ready you can see it's nice and thick you can smoothen it out a little bit more or use it roughly pureed now we are going to rub this on the chicken let the chicken stand in this masala for about an hour if you're short of time 15 minutes will do or if you have plenty of time you can leave it overnight we have marinated the chicken all pieces are thoroughly coated with the masala and we are going to let it stand in the fridge so i'm going to cook the chicken at 400 degree fahrenheit for about 40 45 minutes see the juices are running clear the chicken is cooking nicely we are just going to flip the side to make sure that it's nicely cooked on both sides we want nice and brown on all sides lovely chicken is done now time to serve it just before serving you can add a little bit of lemon juice if you like serve this bhuna masala chicken along with potatoes or with rice great as an appetizer you can enjoy it on its own for lunch for dinner so i hope you will give this recipe a try let us know how it turns out for you and i will see you soon with another exciting recipe so please do stay tuned to et stinlin channel